Good afternoon from BMW and Porsche of Ocala. I'm Scotty, one of the BMW and Porsche product geniuses over here. And today we're going to be taking a look at the all new 2020 BMW 228 Grand Coupe. Now the 228 Grand Coupe is going to be powered by an inline four cylinder turbocharged engine that generates 228 horsepower and about 258 pound feet of torque. And this one being the all wheel drive variant means that power is going to be sent to all four wheels with an intelligent all wheel drive system and paired with an 8-speed automatic transmission. Now, as mentioned, this is the first year of the 228 Grand Coupes because the 2 Series has been out for quite some time now, and as was a replacement for the 1 Series, this car really is kind of its own entity. Although it's called a 2 Series Grand Coupe, it's an entirely different chassis, entirely different motor, entirely different everything. So this car is a 4-door variant, of course, very sharp, and of course, very stylish 3D taillights. The exterior is going to be finished in alpine white. It looks very aggressive, of course, the little vents there, the dual exhaust, the bl uh, gloss black rear diffuser. Of course these 10 spoke alloy wheels and we'll get the size on these in just a moment these are going to be 17 inch alloy wheels front and rear disc brakes as you'd expect of course of course very cool front end as well led daytime running lights led fog lights led headlamps themselves so very nice stuff and also check this out this one has carbon fiber mirrors as well very nice so as much as the exterior of this car is going to be finished in alpine white, but check a look at the interior. We're going to have the magma red Dakota leather interior. Very aggressive looking, very cool. Definitely nice styling about the car. But we're also going to have the convenience package. Now the convenience package gives me comfort keyless access entry, allow me to unlock or lock the car without having to pull out the key. Also gives me satellite radio with a one year subscription. As well as the very nice panoramic moonroof at the top over here. Very sharp. From there, we're also going to have the heated front seats and heated steering wheel option. So as we come inside the car here, of course, we do see the heated steering wheel as well as the heated front seats on both the driver and passenger. Another thing this car is going to have is it's going to have the live cockpit professional. That means, of course, we do have the digital instrument cluster over here as well as with the upgraded iDrive 7.0. If you don't get the uh, live cockpit right over here, you don't get iDrive 7, you get iDrive 6. So, of course, this is the latest and greatest from BMW's infotainment system. Incredibly easy to operate, especially by touchscreen, but also has, of course, the very intelligent voice command system, even with the AC blasting and the radio on. Find me the nearest Italian restaurant. And you can see it just pops them up just as easy as that. Really cool and also very customizable. You can customize everything on these home pages and you can even have multiple home pages. Much like a cell phone, they really wanted to kind of make it like a cell phone. Very cool stuff. We're also going to have automatic headlights, automatic high beams, automatic windshield wipers, all of our cruise control functionality on the left hand side of the steering wheel, all of our media control on the right hand side as well as Bluetooth. So it changes the source voice commands. Very nice stuff there of course. Uh, from there of course, let's go ahead and take a look at the back seats. Of course, the big benefit of the of the, uh, the Grand Coupe is the fact that it does have four doors, as well as, of course, we do have the vents in the rear, as well as two little USB Type Cs for charging your devices. Of course, that Magma Dakota leather interior does transfer to the back as well as you'd expect it to. Very nice. Now let's go ahead and pop the trunk. Of course, the trunk on the Grand Coupe is also very impressive. Of course, nice and flat too, and the seats fold down very easily with just a quick pull of the handle on the left or right hand side to allow you to have extra cargo space. And there's also little bits of hidden extra storage right under here. And I really like that BMW does that, is that they allow you to still have the nice even floor plan, but they also say, hey, if you do need that extra depth, you can remove that. So instead of just having kind of like a pit down there, make it really inconvenient to pull things or put things in, pull things out or push things in, it just makes it very nice and convenient. But if you do have any questions about this car or any other car in our lot for that matter, I should also mention the safety features, even standard safety features, very impressive on this car. Front of collision warning with pedestrian avoidance system, of course, lane departure warning with steering intervention, and even blind spot detection. That's all standard. So very cool car, very budget friendly, especially. Even shows us the speed limit of the road that we're on and everything. But if you do have any questions on this car or any other car in our lot for that matter, please feel free to contact us. We're always happy to get all your questions answered and taken care of. Other than that, we look forward to hearing from you soon and hope you're having a great day. Take care. Bye.